Hello and welcome back to Independent Arts Poem for the Day. Today I'm going to read a poem um, about cats and I'm a bit of a cat fan. I know um, not everybody is but um, uh, there can be a bit of an acquired taste but I'm absolutely um, devoted to, to our little cat uh, and she, she's quite a character. And this poem reminds me of the way cats are so agile and athletic and particularly they find ingenious ways of crawling along the, the tiniest little little ledges. Um, and it's 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 always um, a bit a bit of a worry when uh, they're, they're in pursuit of something smaller than themselves. Um, and this poem um, is a poem by an American poet called Ray Foss, and it's about um, the poet wa watching this this little cat um, uh, moving in on 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 a little little flock of of birds who hopefully managed to to get away successfully. So um, here's the poem. It's called A Cat on a Wire by Ray Foss. A short chain link fence ran along the sidewalk in front of the old New Englander. A short front yard. Just over elbow high, a cluster of birds landed and flew from the wire, the bar, to the flower bed beyond the fence. In the left corner of the side yard, a tabby cat, too young for sense, standing opposite the other end of the fence, eyed the birds. A quick snack, raised and lowering his head, poised to pounce, to jump to the top of the fence, walk like on a tightrope walker, a gymnast on the beam to get his prey. So let's hope those little birds manage to, 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 to fly away. Generally they do, so, um, but I could, I could just imagine that, that, that little, little young cat um, balancing his way along the bar and the wire and, uh, and thinking he might get lucky. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, thank you for tuning in.